apologize. My name is Kevin Caldwell. I'm the Southeast Legislative Manager for the Marijuana Policy Project. Uh, I want to thank Representative Bagley for bringing this bill forward. Uh, we recognize that right now it appears as if HB 697 is going to deal with a lot of the issues that was brought to bear by the Medical Marijuana Commission that uh, Representative Marino brought forth this summer that was authorized by the legislature. Uh, the one point that I would like to bring up uh, to this committee today is Representative Cruz mentioned in previous debate, what is it that our neighbors are doing? And I think it's important that we recognize that we have two authorized growers for therapeutic cannabis in the state of Louisiana, and let's look to see what our neighbors are doing. In Arkansas, a state that has over a million less citizens than the state of Louisiana, they have eight growers. The state of Florida has 22 growers. Oklahoma, which has, a, uh, which has no caps, has uh, well over 1,000 growers. Uh, Missouri has 60 growers. The state of Mississippi adopted a medical cannabis program this year, and they put no caps on the number of growers in their program. So if we are looking to see how our neighbors are proceeding with medical cannabis, uh, I think that it's important to see the fact that we, are, we have a lot more than two growers in all our neighboring medical states. Uh, we can also look at the price point that this kind of competition brings. And the fact is, is that it brings the price point down about 40% from what patients are currently paying. Thank you very much, and I hope that you support Representative Bagley's bill.